Coach, you always talk about it. Defense travels. Huge win today. I tell you, we were outstanding. I thought our, um, you know, our defense, obviously in the first half was terrific. They made some shots there in the second half. We got in foul, uh, you know, they got to the bonus there early in the second half, and it kind of made us a little timid a little bit defensively. Uh, but, uh, I, you know, our effort, we knew it would be this kind of game, whether it was a, a grinder. Um, you know, they just played Houston to a grinder a couple of days ago, and we knew it would be that kind of game. And I'm just proud of how our guys bowed their backs, made, made plays when we need to make plays, made free throws when we need to make free throws. Um, you know, Brandon Rochelle was terrific today. And, and I think, you know, obviously, other than shooting the ball from the perimeter, we did, which we did not do well in, at, uh, uh, from three, but we, we made some nice plays in terms of executing, driving, and finishing around that basket. Coach, you talk about Brandon Rochelle, but I want to talk about your senior, number five, Lawson Carita. Yeah. Ten points, six rebounds, three steals. I mean, are you kidding me? The kid has stepped up big time the last three games. He was unbelievable. And, and you know, he set the tone early in the game with a couple of defensive rebounds with great blockouts, uh, just great focus, great leadership out of him today. And uh, um, so proud of him. I know, you know, he and Martin's senior year, they want to have go out with a bang, and those guys are determined. And uh, today, Lawson, but I, I go back to a couple games. Lawson's been playing well. Uh, I joke with him since he cut the hair, but uh, but he's been terrific, and, and uh, there's no question that you know he played like a senior this this plan to help us get the postseason. Coach, you knew you held him to a season low 11 points at halftime. The defensive rotations were unbelievable in the first half. You knew they were going to make a run in the second half, but you finished the game 23 of 28 from the free throw line. That's just a monstrous on the road, isn't it? It is. It is when you go on a road and 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 uh, be strong and go up there. And make your free throws. We we play a free throw game every day, and our guys are really really good. Uh, went to the line with confidence, and um, you know, just uh, you know, that's how you win on the road. You know, that's how you win when you have a lead. And we worked the game. We held the lead from the start to finish, and that's hard to do on the road. You lead a game from start to finish. You talk about team effort, coach. All ten active players played today. I need to mention the freshman Josh Early. I thought he did a yeah. tremendous job grabbing some boards and, and giving your other bigs a chance to rest. He did. He, you know, you know, he and Manny both, but Josh went there and was live wire. He got a couple of rebounds in traffic, and, and that's what we need uh, to give Martins a, a blow. And uh, and he was terrific today. And I thought Martins was, you know, people were going to come after him. They were swarming him, but there was a it was a great job by Josh and, and Manny too, for the most part, in terms of giving the giving us some minutes in there, some very valuable minutes. Well, I thought Elijah Joyner did a nice job in the second half playing with foul trouble. He, I think he got his third with about 15 minutes to go in the second half. You had to bring him out, but you had to go back to him pretty quick. He did a nice job managing his emotions and playing under control. He did. He did. He's, he's, he's evolved this year. And I, I, you know, I talk about how he's really grown since Christmas, and, um, and I think you just see him getting more and more into the role, what his what we our expectations of him as being a leader of this team on defense and offense. He sets the tone on our defensive side too. So, uh, but he was terrific. Uh, every everything we did everything great, other than you know shoot the ball from three well. And I think you know, but you know sometimes that happens, particularly when you're on the road. And, and we talked about it. So if that happens, what what, what must you do? We must have our defense on point. Uh, we won the rebound and war. They only had six offensive rebounds, and uh, we defended. And that's what you have to do to win on the road. The guy who's been carrying you the last couple games, Martin Zigbanu, obviously didn't have his best offensive effort tonight. But one of the stats on the set, stat sheet is fouls drawn, Coach. He drew seven fouls against South Florida. And he was still a man down there, even though they were trying to take him away. And he went 4-4 four, four from the free throw line. Every one of those was big. Very big. And, and, you know, he's been working on his free throw shooting because he knows he's going to get fouled. And, uh, you know, people are going to come after him. Like East Carolina really came after him. And uh, South Florida came after him. And, and you know, it, it's good to see him, you know, like I said, he and Lawson both as seniors, they're, they're playing like they are seniors and they're playing for something. Coach, this is a team that went on the road and beat Memphis recently. They had won three games in a row up until taking Houston to the wire. This team was preseason number five in the league, and you guys just came here and won. This is a huge victory for your program. Tremendous victory. And, and, I, and I know they don't have Yetna uh, with their team, but uh, that their guard backcourt and Collins and Rideau are terrific. I think, I think Rideau was preseason first team or second team, both those guys on the teams. And uh, um, I just I, I, I knew this was going to be a big game for us and a hard game for us. And, and we came with a, you know, with the hard hat. You know, you have to have that because they're a tough physical ball club. And, uh, 
you know. But uh, like you said, they won three on a row, just one at Memphis, and took Houston right down to the wire. And I think Houston, I mean, they had a play, bang, bang, play. It could go either way, just like tonight. And uh, we knew it was going to be that kind of game.